Dude, D Graves probably doesn't even know. All right, let's see. Whatever. So, we're all rooting against my team. Fuck my team. Okay. Why did who have pink writing on what name? What? Um. All right. So, Starscream looks like he is going for a fiend build, and D Graves is going for a ghoul build, presumably. Um. Everything's pretty standard right now. I am curious what D Graves' playstyle is. It's concealed hill. So, like, going Crippler at Expo, if that was his shtick, won't work too well on this map. Any Expo really is just hard on this map in Undead vs. Undead. Um, although, depending on how Starscream plays it, he might get enough, enough space. It's not Fiends vs. Fiends. Literally, neither of them are going Fast Fiends. One of them is going slow, Fiends, I think. Starscream is going super slow, Hero, that's for sure. Uh, he, he forgot his Hero. This is a great start against my team. I want my team to lose. My team needs to lose. My team wins too hard, guys. Oh, motherfucker, he's doing Nortra Car shit. Okay, actually, no, I think his build's just wrong. Okay, Starscream is a little bit out of practice. He, he already said he hasn't practiced that much. I think, and I, and I think this is a big I think, I think he wanted to go Fiends, but he forgot his graveyard. Because he's not making a second Zig, and normally when you start to scout, you put down your graveyard. Okay, no, he's just going, all right, whatever, I'll work with him on that one. Okay, they both need to work on their builds, but I, I predicted wrong. We got both ghouls, although the guy who I said was going ghouls may go fiends quicker than the guy who I said was going fiends is going to go fiends. Honestly, Savior, that's why when like people are always like, at a lower MMR, you need a scout. I've had people who are like, when I go, you, you might want to know if like someone's going pally rifle, and they're like, how the fuck do I know that they're going pally rifle? And I'm like, dude, it's like the easiest thing in the world to identify, but then I realize... Shit, everything's new. I've been playing this game for 20 fucking years. I kind of know when shit's happening. Oh, I'll show you when it's happening. It's pretty, that's pretty easy. But then again, you know, like I said. Uh-oh, start screaming. Woohoo! D Graves in lead. Damn, Starscream's gonna feel bad. Uh, I hope he realizes. I'm sabotaging him with love. Alright, we are getting an expo. So this is ballsy. It's gonna pay off because D Graves is. Player's forces are under attack. Nowhere. He's uh he's just doing some standard creeping, but this is gonna take forever. Um okay, some ghouls are coming, but. He did, he's not making that many ghouls. So the real question is, will Starscream lose a lot doing this? It looks like it's mostly just critters and shit dying. Talisman of Evasion, not bad. D Grapes doesn't get any item from this. That's Sag. I thought he was going to Expo for a second. Yeah, uh, Clave, you know, that's actually, imagine, like, to, to tell the difference between Tier 2 and Tier 3, um, imagine, like, one of them is not a place of worship, and the other one is a place you go for worship. Oh, God, he's already, this I do not like from D-Grapes, he's already grow going for... I mean, if it if if he gets like an early timing, then fuck yeah, I'll eat my words. But he's going fiends with an upgrade. But that's gonna be so much wood, and he doesn't have wood right now. Is he gonna 
see it. No. Oh, this is gonna be level three. D Graves totally misses it. He's also going for more creeping, which is gonna potentially. The town is under siege. He's never. He's not gonna be able to stop this. I hope he doesn't aim it. I hope he aims the acolytes. That would be the proper move here because you're never gonna take this out. Oh god. Okay. He's. I thought he was going for the zig. I'm like, that's actually the worst thing you can do. So this is good because Starscream started the tech. So he's got to just Nova. Nova. Again. Oh, he already Nova. All right, so nice shot from Starscream to pull him back. He did lose one, almost two. Um, it kind of sucks because, you know, he wanted to attack and all that. Ooh, Starscream. He went for Impale level two instead of Beatles. That's that's also, that's also a mistake. Um, Beatles level two are just super strong, much better than Beatles level one. And Impale, like getting it to level two Unless you're like later game, doesn't really mean that much. Early game, it's really not to kill shit that you do it. It's usually just to stun them. I think D, gave, D Graves tried to build the slaughterhouse and it got blocked by the ghoul, which is always a pain in the ass. Yeah, there you go. He is stuck tier two. I don't love it. Okay, see, look. See this little horn thingy? Eh, well, we gotta wait. That. See, that's like uh, you worship at this place. This just looks like a shitty, you know, sag building. A player's forces are under attack. Right? So that's tier two. Tier three looks like that, but, you know, not green. All right, so D Graves is still level two, which is fucking miserable for him. He would love, if he had level three right now, he'd be blowing shit up. But as is, he doesn't. Starscream is getting another tower, not the best position, but it should cover most things. Good reaction from Starscream. He, he ran right away. Um, does give him level three, which sucks, but he doesn't have mana, so that's fine. He's got plenty of gold now. I'm a little worried for D Graves. He's getting a lot of upgrades, right? But upgrades are not going to win him this game because Starscream is going to flood him with units. Like right now, right? It's just Beetle. Oh, no. Yeah. Nice TP pass. But that also means D Graves ain't coming back anytime soon. We actually gave D Graves another game this week too. Which one was that? Uh, Crimson. I think he's like 850 as well. All right. I don't know. A player's sport under attack. This is so much damage. All right. No orb yet for D Graves. That is the thing. As an undead, you have to get the orb. You have to. As soon as you get tier three, you get that orb. The orb is the winner. Like right now, him fighting versus Starscream, he should win if he has the orb, but he doesn't. So Starscream is gonna just keep pulling ahead with the unit. Like the when when an undead expo is an undead versus undead, you really need to hit you need to delay the expo if you can, which D Graves did to some extent. But then the other part of that is you need to usually hit a tier three timing. He's gonna try and tier three expo, it looks like, but the problem with that is gonna be Keeping it alive if Starscream is active with like his beetles and shit, they can just cancel the expo. It, 
it's super hard to keep an undead expo alive. Especially when you're not like putting down blight first and putting down uh, anything. D Graves also does have to be careful with the DK level two. Ooh. Ooh. No! No, he no 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 oh, fuck! That could have been an amazing creep jack. I'm sorry, sorry, scream, I keep rooting against you. What is Cripplord's third ability? Um, it's basically gives it gives it more armor. That's the big part of it. You know that he has that ability because he gets spikes literally on his back. I think it re returns damage and also gives more armor. So he would have literally spikes coming out of his back. It's a passive. Dr. Third with silence. But no orb! Holy shit. The expo looks like it will go up. Uh, Starscream's been super passive. Which is not a problem considering he has the expo, but... On the other hand, if he does scout it out, he might just be able to kill it unless D Graves literally TPs right away and runs over there. Silence on the Necros doesn't necessarily work if the guy gets destroyers. I'm not a fan of Necros in this matchup, however, it could overwhelm at a lower MMR. I mean, fuck, it overwhelms me when fucking Koss does it. Butthole. This isn't the Starscream I think you know, Ed Williams. There's a Starscream-er, a German. This guy is Starscream, the American. I'm, I'm not liking Starscream's army. Like, at this point, these Necros, sh they may win him the game. Honestly, they may. But I don't, I, I don't like it because there are, there is an easy response to it. Oh no. D Graves doesn't know. A player's force disease cloud. Gives a bombs a disease cloud aura that deals two damage per second to nearby enemy units. That's a lie if you read the last line. Undeads undead are immune to disease cloud. It ain't gonna do fuck all. Look, see spikes. Spikes on his back. Damn, D Graves is only getting the expo up now. He just he's been starved for wood because of the upgrades he's going for. Especially Disease Cloud, that was two hundred. Anyway, there's a fight happening. So remember when I said Necros are bad units? They're good if D Graves is not sucking everything up, which he's not. Oh my god, he used Burrow. He doesn't know. Well, this is not going to end well. So a super anti-timing attack for D Graves. Um, he did a lot right at the start, but like you just got your expo up. Now is not the time to attack, right? Now is the time to sit back and grab more shit. He's now going double slaughterhouse. I'm not okay, sure why, because he's not attack. building anything. Hmm. I'm gonna go PM Tim after this. Ooh. He has some fiends left here. 
He did get the orb. Just way, 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 way too late. So he does recognize orb imbalance, but. All right. Yeah, this game is. God damn it. All right, time to go help the other team. Thanks. By the way, for this game at tier three, get your orb ASAP. Dude, this game's over. There's no fucking shot. I'm not even looking. And destroyers suck up necro. Alright, I'm telling him some shit. And now I'm gonna go tell Starscream to stop fucking winning, goddammit. Dude, this is the worst feeling. When when your team starts winning, but they start winning so fucking hard that you look like you're sabotaging the other team. I don't even know what I said. I have the best jokes. People have told me that. Very smart people have told me that. You can write in italics and fucking Twitch? What the shit? I was trying to type to them wrong EI if you're going EI, but... Well, we're playing old... <laughs> we're playing old EI. Fuck. Oh well. Listen. If you can't tell what map you're playing on, it's not going to fucking make a difference in the long run anyway. Alright, so this game, D Graves, is going a different build than he did last time. Star Screams is kind of the same. What, you mean they're gonna mine out the map and then we're gonna be sitting there like, oh fuck. All right, Crip Lord and Lich again, though. I'm really not a fan of either of the builds. They both went for early heroes, but the heroes are both heroes that really need units with it. So, I would be getting Crip Altar at the start, not Crip Zig. Or, I mean, Altar Zig. You don't want to get Alter Zig, you want to get Alter Crypt. A player's 
forces are under attack. So, D Graves is keeping a lot more on wood this time around. A third zig. Is he going for his own expo this time? All right, I have no fucking idea, D-Graves. You, you got me. Are we tower rushing? Okay, the Acolyte's down there. It was but a dream. Player's forces are under attack. I mean, the timing ain't bad, right? He's gonna run in. Hopefully, he can do a lot of damage. Again, sorry, Starscream. I'm rooting against you. Holy shit, double crit. This is a really late crit, though. If he had done that earlier, I would have felt a lot better about it, but he didn't. Alright, that's always a bitch. Gets ensnared means he can't put down his expo right away. But, how much damage will d be able to do right here? Starscream's... I was going to say didn't notice, but he, did, he does. He does. He's putting down an extra zig, which probably actually isn't needed, considering he has one over here. So, luckily, uh, d Graves is not aiming it. Okay, he's aiming it. We do have an impale that can be lined up. Oh no, he ate. Did he eat a ghoul? Star Screams has to pull all the ghouls. He's got to. Do not lose your hero. There's an impale. Alright. Fuck it. We're aiming heroes, baby. So. If D Graves had been teching behind this. I would feel great about this, right? Like, he slowed down the expo. He pulled all the ghouls. Killed some ghouls. But he, and you know, he's halfway to level three. But he didn't. He didn't expo. I mean, he didn't tech. So this tech should be like here or here. On the bright side, D Graves is doing a lot of moving around the map. Okay, please do not create this. Oh, no. I was going to say, if he just runs over here and... Fuck. He just cancels the expo. Again, sorry, sorry, Scream. I am totally rooting against you in the... In the uh, belief of... I want a closer matchup. Oh, fuck. Okay, now fuck. We're back. Oh, I get why he's not doing it, but I would have YOLO'd it. Ooh, now here's a problem. What's he gonna do now? All his shit's okay. Never mind. He got an upgrade we've never seen in a long time. Half of you didn't even know this makes a sound when you do it, did you? Why is it called cannibalism when he's not eating other ghouls? That's just, that's a wrong fucking name. He ate an ogre. He's not a cannibal. Starscream still tier one. A player's forces are under attack.
Yeah, we'll disengage. He's a cow, and he's a cow. Bam. Got him. Oh, dokey. So this is just, he's got to be careful. I mean, I like the delaying factor, but he's got to be careful. He doesn't just get surrounded, like, right now. He, he's very close to getting surrounded. He's so close to getting surrounded. Giga Chad move. Star Scream has to TP out. Oh, no. The accolades are going with it. Okay, but the problem is a lot of ghouls really, really fucking hurt. Again, star, star Scream for rooting against you, but you need to fucking lose. Oh, my God. The deny. All right. Star Scream is coming back. He did use the healing. He's up to 200 life. This Lich, though, looking pretty healthy. Looking pretty fit. Looking slim. Looking ready to go. He did cancel the upgrade on that, which was good. The ghouls are coming. I mean, the accolades are coming back. Um, no more no more skellies coming out. For the graves. That, that impale... I mean, it, 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 it's what he has to do in this situation. But he's definitely not feeling too great right now. Now, behind this, going to your tree. Oh, fuck me. Dude, this expo hasn't done fuck all. All right, D Graves is cooking. I better not say too much because he might just like lose his lich like right now. Jesus. This is a dead, haunted, cold mine. So this is D. Graves. This is D. Graves' game. It's going to be super hard for Starscream to come back into. He did get Impale level 2, not Beatles level 2, once again. So the ghouls are better Beetle, or better than the Beatles. If, if he had gotten level 2 Beatles, the Beatles would have been pretty much better than the ghouls. We're getting some upgrades too. Fuck. He's got to be careful though. Like he's running in. Okay. I was going to say, you're getting way too close. So, we're running into the same problem again, which is D Graves doesn't have an orb. I would also like Frenzy right now. Might as well. Right, there we go. Forces are under attack. Will ghouls die? Of course. How many ghouls? Dude, cannibalize. That time he might actually be eating one of his own brethren. So Starscream doesn't know what to do. There is no real good answer right now, right? But like he's like, shit, I lost my expo. I'm behind on tech. 
Like, what are you supposed to do here? I'm on the wrong Echo Isles, which I can't even tell them about. And if I leave, it won't make a fucking difference. Why do they, like, I mean, I kind of understand the reasoning. Like, what? it's not Warcraft 3 or W3C's job to, like, remove maps. But I do, and I, I mean, I get it, you know, like, this might come back one day. But when there's, like, two versions of a map. Maybe, like, we can talk to Kovacs about, like... Maybe like big bold letters after Echo Isles, like, hey asshole, this is the old version. Alright. Damn, we're going all in on these uh, ghoul upgrades. So Starstream is just looking to re-expo. I mean, you already had the Acolytes. Um... And he is going tier 3 anyway. So I guess he's like, fuck it, why not? We'll set, We'll have to see. But I mean, so so is D-Graves. D-Graves looks like he wants to expo as well. It's still going to be later. We're going DL this game, though. I, I, I like that. Let's see, though, if he sucks up the Beatles. Yes, he would, Glaive. But he, he's not, so, you know, I'm not saying anything. Okay, we're going right for the DK. Cause fuck you, DK. Dude, this is so many fiends. No, do not, oh my God. He's aiming the worst thing in the world to aim. Suck up, suck this shit up. Oh no, not like this. He's still not using the ability to suck it up. So this expo is going to be fine. It's a lot of fiends. No! I This is my fault. I forgot to tell him. This shit don't work. Now with that attitude, it's not savior. I forgot that he used to be in this position. Damn, and now I'm reading my PM real quick. I was telling D Graves what to do and he goes, yeah, my bad. I don't want to hear that as I'm criticizing you in a new game. Fifty-five food to fifty-eight food for Star Screen. Um, two O upgrades to one O upgrades. If only there was more things to creep on this map. So now it's Star Screen, which Here's made the whoopsie daisy back. of not having ooh BBDs. BBDs are going to be amazing this game if he gets to them. Um. But, uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, he doesn't have an orb. Alright. Let's see it. Here comes maybe not the fight. 
Wait. He does have a TP, so it's not going to be like a surround and a kill. And D Graves is scared, and I don't blame him. Like, his army isn't good right now. A lot of it's just ghouls. They're going to melt versus this. Yep, there it goes. I mean, Frosties are definitely the right thing in this case. You're facing A bombs, ghouls, and shit. Why not? I don't think D Graves just doesn't know what to do right now. He he can't break this, not with this. He could 100% be killing fiends though. Like the lich just can poke and kill, honestly with novas because a DK level one can not really keep everything alive. I he definitely he doesn't know about this either. And that's gonna blow up these A bombs in like three shots. Like if he gets like two if you get two frosties, I'm pretty sure they like Oh my god, look at that damage. This is what I mean. Like, okay, what are you gonna do? Coil it once if he just Nova's again. Next Nova, that's gonna be another dead anything. He could be sleeping as well. These are all kills D Graves could be having. I get it. It's a lot, and oh boy. The BBD is out on the field. That that might just be a game winner right there. Honestly. Oh, nope. Okay, D Graves saw it. He's going Gargs. Which I like. Um if there's no web, I don't know if there is. I don't think I've seen the destroyer get webbed yet. What the fuck? You know what would be a Giga Chad move? Run in, kill this, and TP out. Instead, he's going for the slaughterhouse. Uh-oh. Getting slowed? No, the destroyer might just get auto web. Still no orb for Starscream. I know, why don't you go up here and creep? Alright, here we go. Look at the damage. If only he had an orb. Alright, that DK. Already half-life because someone has an orb. Gotta suck it up, suck it up. Start sucking. Oh my god. That impale, but that DK should be dead. Shit. Wait. One BBD down. Can he eat the other one? Alright. These heroes... The heroes are doing fucking work. Nover! 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 I'm sorry, sorry, Scream. He's totally gonna leave my team after the amount of shit I've been saying. Alright. Alright. He's still level one. He's still fucking dead. Hero nuke for the win. Kill the BBD. Kill the BBD with Nover. And love. Oh, why? Why does that scroll in sometimes? Dude, this is all just food for this... This lich. He's just gotta be careful he doesn't, like, lose his heroes. Uh-oh. Mass Towers. How the fuck did this work out? Also, what the fuck is this guy doing? Luckily, the Naruto Tower is not looking this way. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait. Okay. I was going to say, what the fuck? I think we can say D Graves probably won this game. I am saying probably because I have a feeling he may back up from all these towers. So the game's going to continue. Well, not if he loses. Ooh, just one Nova. 
Is that CL gonna get out? Uh oh, two BBDs. The CL is gonna come out. And it's on the right side of things, so it, it doesn't like auto die. But. Oh shit, he popped the invul right away? One Frosty down, the other Frosty is super weak. He's gonna die. Or not die. He can heal, he can heal the DL still. So he's in a good spot. We're going game three. Uh, Hyper Real and Savior, if you want to wait for this game. If not, I'll just watch it on stream after. Alright, so the mains are dry. And we are going game three. Game tree. Fuck you, A-Camp. God damn it, I'm going to keep saying this now. All right. How did he win with facts and logic? But you don't understand that because you're a Ben Shapiro fan. He nuked the fuck out of the heroes. That's pretty much how. Where's game three? I know. That should be the game name. It's not showing up. What the fuck? What server are we on? I don't even know where D Graves is from. I'm not saying shit about that being the wrong Echo Isles. I don't want to hear anything later. Alright, so we are going game three. I don't know what map he's got it set for Amazonia, which just means he ain't, you know, set it yet. That definitely is not one of the maps. I can say that for sure. LR, okay. People love their standard maps. I mean, I don't blame them. I'm the same way, but like... I don't know. I, I don't want to play other games, like other maps, but I want, I want to watch other people have to play other maps. If that makes sense. There's not much to say, so I'm fucking tired. I may have streamed already today and already lost to Yanji on stream. It's been a tiring day. Sag. All right. <laughs> Starscream has to go to the bathroom. D Graves asked me, is this the right LR? No, it's not. Holy fuck. They have random. I didn't realize this. I, Dude, you guys need to fucking name these better. They're on random hero. They went to ladder. Thank God. But like, what does RH mean to people? Like to new players.
All right, we're just waiting. All right, we're in. Ooh, we're going fiends. Fast fiends. So we're doing something totally different for Starscream. Um, D Graves, I think he's going to be a Lich player again. Yes, he, he has a concept of a plan. So, is Starscream going for, like, Nortra Car Fiends, or is he going to go DK this game? To be fair, Hitler would want to kill Ben Shapiro. So they are kind of opposites in that regard. Just throwing that out there. Oh no, Starscream. Well, maybe he's doing a whole different fucking build, but he got a he got another accolade, which is gonna throw off everything on this ma on this shindig.
You just wanted to look at his penis. All right, it's DK, but not a second zig. He went fast. Oh, Kidoki. This is a interesting build from Starscream. I think he did what he did intentionally, um, but it is a little bit off. I think you could have done the same thing a little bit quicker if you just went uh, alter zig and then went for like a faster DK. But we'll see. Now, D Grave shouldn't kill anything here. But he can make Starscream burn some mana. Oh my god, maybe he will kill something. Why? Why not? Just fucking nuke it! He's not coiling it! He honestly could have killed that. Again, why am I rooting for Degrips? Not even on my team. A town is under siege. So D Graves tech is quite a bit behind Star Screams. But D Graves is gonna take the offense early because Starscream didn't have a second zig, so he can, he's really stuck on one feet. So what's he gonna be able to creep after this? And Williams, you can say a lot about Ben Shapiro, but I'm pretty sure you can't call the man extremely in favor of Israel, and not to mention extremely Jewish, a Nazi. Just saying. Alright. Some weak ghouls that'll just kind of... If Starscream mains them, they're going to just go straight down. I would like for him to send those back to heal. That's one ghoul dead, I heard. This one's somehow still alive for now. Ooh, cannibalize. And that is one of his friends on the ground. Oh, fuck me. That's two down. No. God, no. Oh, my fucking... Thank you. No, not that one either. Are you fucking insane? So. Starscream has a quicker tech. A player's forces are under attack. But they're both chill in tier 2 right now. Never mind. Tier 3 started. D Graves could also pop his tier 3. I'm going to talk to Shibby about for Fantasy League blocking people from seeing who I pick. Or, or I'm going to actually talk to Shibby about putting up the exact opposite bets that I would make so that Cage starts picking the wrong fucking things. Because he's just copying me. Damn, Glaive looked up whose teams he's on. Honestly, Glaive, when we made that match, Potato was 1640.
Holy shit. Yeah, put those all over there. Plus 12 armor. 47% damage reduction. That's kind of fucking insane. A player's forces are under attack. Yeah, well, to be fair to Potato, I don't think part of his strategy was you running up here, pulling the creep to kill you. Alright, tier 3 is here. We don't have orbs yet. That feels bad that that's a circlet drop. Like, I was looking for, like, what drop? And then I remembered circlet. They moved it. He forgot a fiend as well, which will certainly hurt. DR? Okay. This could be a really good item, or it could be completely useless, let's say. That's not bad at all. Is anyone who wants to help in future seasons with like either coaching or like tangents of GNL, like fantasy league and shit? Um, we do it all via Google Excel sheet, so it's not really like heavy knowledge and shit. Oh my god, the grapes. That guy is gonna be on a fucking mission to smack you in the face. Oh, and then, look at that. Look at your reward. You pick... You, rule number one, you never pick a coach for your team. Because the coaches rarely put themselves in a game. Although, maybe that's actually Big Brain, because he did increase the amount of people points you get for people sitting. So, Floss is just automatically going to generate you points. Dude. So many A-bombs. Please, D Graves, don't get him. Don't don't get disease cloud again. Motherfucker. Like I just found out. Lucky Strike has 23 players right now. Okay, Lucky Strike, you get two players. <sighs> Fuck. A player's forces are under attack. How do they only have 28 to begin with, though? They have 29.
Okay. Back to the game. Wait. We got fell blade and more bent fell. So like fell bent and then fell blade. Why is everything a fell? What the fuck is fell? I don't know how I feel about Breaking Benjamin making more songs. Like, Diary of Jane is goaded. Which just scares me they're gonna suck ass. Does he see? He does. Okay, you can't even nuke these. So, they're gonna be able to run away. At least one. One might die. It doesn't die! Oh, no. Oh, Jesus. So, this time Starscream's got the hero levels that you didn't have last time. That DK? Okay, that DK was just barely in range. I mean, there's just so many A-bombs that, like, destroyers would kill it, but... Uh... Well, oh, fuck me. Oh, I hate when this happens. If he... This lich may die. Okay, this lich is just gonna run the fuck away. Nope, the lich is gonna die. Oh, fuck. What the fuck? Wait, this lich is gonna die too? No, it's not. What the fuck is happening? A DR is dead. A lich is dead. This looks like my last game versus fucking Yanji. I'm beating the shit out of him, and then suddenly all my shit's dead. Z Graves is feeling a Z Groove. Damn, that's a lot of destroyers. He needs to hockey these up. Because now if he moves whatever unit, I think the Lich that it's following, Nova. I am so sorry, Starscream, for rooting against you, but our team needs to fucking lose some games or else I look bad. I don't really give a shit about you. This is all about perception of me. Oh my God, this DK, dude. 
he had a TP, yeah. He's scared of the Nova, but the Nova, nope, okay, he just used the Nova. Ooh, he's just going straight for the DK. DK does not have Death Pack, so he's gotta be careful. But all the A-bombs, they're starting to melt. D Graves is gonna take this two to fucking one. I was scared after game one. Damn, Starscream looked really good in game one. But uh, D Graves came back. The GG was called and the GG is happening. And we got us a 2-1.